So we have a Bible reading from Matthew chapter 11. At that time, Jesus prayed this prayer. O Father, Lord of heaven and earth, thank you for hiding these things from those who think themselves wise and clever and for revealing them to the childlike. Yes, Father, it pleased you to do it this way. My Father has entrusted everything to me. No one truly knows the Son except the Father, and no one truly knows the Father except the Son, and those to whom the Son chooses to reveal him. Then Jesus said, Come to me, all of you who are weary and carry heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you. Let me teach you, because I am humble and gentle at heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy to bear, and the burden I give you is light. We have the song, It is well with my soul. Now we're going to have a, a period of open prayer or private prayer.
we conclude our prayers with this modern version of the Lord's Prayer, which is based on the old version that Jesus taught, which was in the language of the day, the language of the everyday people. Could you then join me in praying this? Our Dad in heaven above, let everyone look up to you and the area where you are in charge grow. May what you want happen on earth as perfectly as it does in heaven. Please give to us what we need for today. Forgive us when we think or do wrong things, just as we don't hold it against those who hurt us. Guide us away from whatever we might want but is unhelpful to us, and protect us from all that is nasty and destructive. For you are in charge of everything. You have the power to do it, and you are awesome. You always were, you are now, and always will be. Amen. And this is uh, a version of the prayer that we've been using in the diocese uh, to pray for the work of our churches here and the work of God's people in this area. Living God, Jesus calls his followers to grow to know him and to follow him that others might know him too. Renew us as we grow in your love and make your love known. Release us to share freely together in loving care and words and rejuvenate us to be fruitful. Give us courage, wisdom and compassion that, strengthened with the undeserved goodness of the Holy Spirit, we may both flourish and grow in Jesus. Amen. So be it. May your hearts be at peace and your minds be at rest. May you be confident in who you are and share God's gifts of light, hope and grace with those you meet and those you pray for. And may the blessing of God fill your hearts with hope this day and evermore. Amen. I've managed to uh, get a, a bit of a, a nice white dot uh, in the middle of my uh, airbrush thing by doing it layer after layer after layer, which is how you do airbrushing to get uh, solid things. And it's how we get to know Jesus, by going bit by bit by bit, step by step, one day at a time, sweet Jesus, uh, is one of the songs. And uh, hopefully your experience will be like mine, that as you get to know him better, it, it's a wonderful, exciting journey, uh, very powerful and effective in your own spirituality and the way that you relate to others and the way that you build your life and giving you great hope. Uh, so hopefully you'll be back next week to uh, learn some more and uh, we can discuss that together. All the best. Bye.